All right, so I sent my S22 Ultra in for a trade-in for the S23 Ultra. Now, they rejected my S22 Ultra because the screen is cracked. And here is the device returned because I requested it to be returned. So let's open the box and see the cracked screen for ourselves. Okay, I sent this phone in the original package that it came in. The, the black box that says S22 on it has the serial number on the box and everything. And they're just sending it back to me like this. So, no box. So, now I want to resell it. I can't give the person I sell it to the original box because Samsung decides not to give it to me. And they took the S Pen. They seriously took the S Pen from the phone. Are you kidding me? Alright, this is the best view I can get of the scratches on the screen. So there are a couple scratches. But the screen is not cracked. The body is not cracked. The phone is in really good condition. And here you can see the LCD is 100% perfect. All right, so this is the 512 gigabyte graphite version, which is a Samsung online exclusive. So this phone is worth quite a bit for reselling. Now, before I can resell it, obviously I have to contact Samsung, see if I can get my S Pen back. And I highly doubt it, it's probably in the trash already, but I would like to also get the original box back as well so I can sell it in that box. Now I traded this phone in for, yes, I know it's practically giving this phone away $500. So the deal was they take $500 off my purchase for this phone, which they could make a hefty amount of profit on. So the only reason I didn't decide to sell it in the first place is because I figured it was more convenient just to send it back to them as a trade-in but now they decide to do this. I have a lot of Samsung devices. I have the phone, I have the tablet, I have this, their TV. I like the Samsung products, but this is just ridiculous. They tried to take back $150 for a cracked screen. You know what I think it was? I think they were just trying to get another $150 out of me and be able to resell the phone. I don't think they thought I would actually request the phone back. So you know what? F you, Samsung. Yeah, this just pisses me off. If you haven't heard about uh, Samsung being anti-repair, uh, check out Lewis Rossman's channel. He's done some videos recently where he's gone over how Samsung is trying to get a general exclusionary act or something that would prevent aftermarket sellers from selling OLED screens. So I am really questioning if I am ever going to buy anything from Samsung again, and I've given them a lot of money. I I do like the products, but the company themselves, this is this is just ridiculous. Like, where's my S Pen? Where's my box? Why are you calling this a crack screen? Like this will still resell for a large amount. They could easily profit off this. They did not need to request the $150 back. They're just pissing me off at this point. Okay, so I just got off the phone with Samsung support. Um, apparently it is their policy that you send in the device itself, not the pen, and they don't want the box. So the box might most likely got thrown in the trash. I can't get that back. The S Pen, I cannot get back. However, when I finally got to talk to a supervisor, thank you, Derek, um, he is forwarding a promo code to my email for $100 for the Samsung store. And the S Pens are $50. So he's actually giving me an extra $50 on top of the S Pen replacement, which I am appreciative of. He also said he was going to try to get an additional $50 because of the box missing, I believe. I'm thinking most likely that the $50 for the box will be rejected, but 
Um, at least he told me he would try. I don't know if he said that just to appease me, but I wasn't expecting to get anything for the box missing anyways. That's not a surprise. Moral of the story, do not trade in your phone to Samsung. Don't do it. Uh, sell your phone on eBay. Give it to a family member or a friend. Do not give it to Samsung. If you're going to buy items from Samsung, just pay their price and sell what you have to make up that cost. That being said, considering the prices for the S22, S23, don't buy them. It's more worth to find a place to, to buy the S21. It'll be a much better price. It's still practically the same phone, honestly. All right, so I got the money in my email for the promo code. So I went to the Samsung shop to try to redeem the S Pen. Now, the store doesn't have the graphite version, which that's fine. If I could get like a black or a white one, that would go with the phone. That's perfectly fine. So the black one is out of stock. The green one is out of stock. The white one, they do have. But when you want to purchase it, item cannot be purchased. So I cannot get the S Pen. I have to sell the phone without it if possible. F*** Samsung.